Okay, so we have a question. Contest. A contestant has won one spin of the wheel at the right to find the expected value of his winnings. So we need to create the table. So we're going to have a value for x. Now on our spinner here, we have some data. So starting here, it says no prize 20%. So this is going to be zero. So when x is zero, there's no prize, and this is 20%. So we can write this as a decimal, so 0 0.20. So this here is going to be our probability of getting a capital X value. So next, so we have 5,000. So this is 5,000, and the probability is 36% or 0 0.36. So then we have 10,000. So 10,000, which is 22 or 0 0.22. We have 15,000, which is going to be 0 0.14. We have 25,000, which is going to be 0.08%. So this is our table. So we can add a border. So let's put all borders. And we can format. And we can change the row height. So we'll make this a bit bigger. So let's say uh, 25, so nice and big. So our data, we just increase the size. So that's better, we can now see, and then let's fill, let's fill this in. And here's our data. So, what we need to do is find the expected value. So the expected value of our variable, random variable of x. So we can calculate this. Okay, so the expected value is the sum of, so we're going to have our square brackets. Okay, so the expected value is the sum of our x multiplied by the probability. So we're going to just calculate that by here. So our expected value, so expected value, so we'll put it by here, equals, and we're going to do our x, and it's going to be multiplied by our probability, and then we need to add. So multiplied by our probability, and then add the next column, multiplied by our probability, add our next column, multiplied by our probability, and then add our final, multiplied by our probability. And this is going to be 8,100. So if we were to look at our spinner, it's in dirhams. So our expected value is going to be 8100 dirhams. Okay, so there we go. 8100 dirhams if we were to spin the spinner. So that is the weighted average. Okay, so another question. Prizes. Harib won a ticket for a prize. The distribution of the values of the tickets and the frequencies are shown below. Find the expected value of his winnings. So the first thing we need to do is sum our frequencies. So we can do this with equals sum. And then we're going to highlight our frequencies. And we know the total is 5,132. So what we need to do now is calculate the probability. Okay, so the probability, this is going to be equal to 5,000 divided by, 
and it's going to be the fixed value so I'm going to use this and it's going to be it's going to be our 512 which is in H6 okay let's put in our dollar sign so in there so that's fixed now we're going to copy and we can drag this across to calculate our probabilities now these are all in decimal okay and if i was to work the sum so the total of the prob probability is going to equal one so our expected value so we're just going to sum so let's put that over there so our expected value we are going to equal so we're going to multiply so it's going to be our value here so this is going to be multiplied by our probability and we're going to add so this is going to be the amount multiplied by the probability and we're going to add the amount multiplied by the probability and we're going to add the amount multiplied by the probability add the amount multiplied by the probability and then we're going to add the oops and then so add our final one multiplied by our probability and equals so this is 8.456 so we can round this so if we format there's a number zero decimal places or should we say one decimal place so this is going to round to 8.5 so our expected value so for Harab's winnings is going to be eight point five dirhams.